Hi guys, so today I wanted to do the what's in my bag tag and I love watching these videos because you can get really great ideas of what to bring in your purse that are small and compact that you probably wouldn't think of um, yourself and so yeah I really like watching these just kind of get an idea of like what I should be bringing in my purse every day and everyone's different and so yeah I just wanted to share with you guys what I have in my bag. So the bag that I am currently using is the Rebecca Minkoff Mini Mac and this is in the color Freesia and I got this for Christmas from my parents so thank you parents I absolutely love this bag it is the only bag I wear now and I like that it's small and compact and it's really light I just I want to get basically this in every single color and I got this in the mint color but my denim actually died off onto the back of the bag and so I ended up returning it so I would be wary if you are um, picking out a lighter color in this bag just because your denim dye might rub off on the bag. Other than that, this product is just amazing. Love it. I cannot say anything bad about it because I just absolutely love it. And I really do want to get another color. Just don't know which one. Anyways, okay. So enough rambling about my purse. Um, I'm going to show you what is inside and I haven't look through it so yeah I'm not really sure um so this is what it looks like when you open it up and you can see that my wallet takes up basically the entire thing and this is a Gucci wallet and I just love this because it's actually for a big wallet it's pretty compact and it zips open got all my cards everything cash uh, it's got a coin purse and yeah that's I mean Got a lot of cards, a lot of little mini things like Froyo rewards cards and stuff like that. Um, okay, so the next thing I have in my bag is this little um, mirrored comb thing. And this stuff is actually comes in so handy. I don't want to be blinding you guys, but this stuff comes in so handy. Um, I always like saw these and I was like, oh, those are stupid. Like, why would you carry around like a comb thing? I don't know. But honestly, I use this every single day, especially because I commute to work, so I'm on the bus and my hair gets a little ratty after just sitting there for a couple hours. So I like to use this and comb out my hair and you can use the mirror to apply your makeup and it's just honestly such a great invention. So that I definitely recommend. Um, the next thing is Altoids Mint and these are the Simply Mint Flavor Sugar Free. And they're just like the mini, mini ones. And this is like small and compact, so I like that. Next thing I have is the baby lips. And this is, I have, oh, it's in the flavor grapevine. And it smells like candy grapes. I actually really like the scent of it. And it's moisturizing. I'm not a huge baby lips fan. I don't think it's like the best moisturizing thing, but it's like, when you're in a pinch and you have chapped lips, it kind of helps a little bit. So there's that. Ooh. The next thing I have in my purse is also a Maybelline product. And this is their Vivids collection. And this is the color Hot Plum. And this is the most beautiful, beautiful purpley pink color. It looks really intimidating in the tube, but it's actually not so bad. I'll swatch it for you guys. That's what it looks like. And it is so gorgeous. I love wearing this. Just like when you really don't have much makeup on, you throw this on. It totally changes your look. The next thing I have is by Rimmel London and this is the Match Perfection 2-in-1 Concealer and Highlighter. And I really like this. It's really easy. It's kind of like the Touche Clot, um, but a much cheaper version. And it's like that. You just brush it on. Great. Super easy. I love these highlighter products because I like using like a very creamy product under my eye. So that's good on the go. The next thing I have in my purse are contacts. And yeah, I just have these in case I feel like wearing them while I'm at work or whatever. So um, I have the AccuV One Day Moist Contacts. And I have really dry eyes. So these are great because you just wear them once and then you throw them out at the end of the day. And they don't really like get all gunky and stuff. So the next product I have is another Rimmel London product and this is their eyeliner in the color Nude and this is just the perfect um, nude color to wear on your waterline and it just brings your eyes and looks really wide and awake so I like bringing this 
it's perfect it's really creamy and it lasts all day so I really like that so the next thing I have in my purse is the Maybelline color whisper in the color pink possibilities and this is what it looks like and that is the swatch of it it's just a really beautiful baby pink color and it's very hydrating it's great on the go to just kind of throw it on the next thing that I have in my purse is the Jerlique Rose Hand Cream, and I got this in one of my birch boxes, and it's just easy, throw in your purse, it's pretty compact, and yeah, I like it, it's moisturizing, and I'm not a huge, I'm not a huge rose scented fan, but it actually doesn't smell too bad, so yeah, I do like using that. The next thing I have is the Vaseline Lip Therapy, and I honestly just bought this because it was really cute. It's like a baby Vaseline bottle, and it works really well to moisturize your lips. This is probably the lip product that I reach for the most if I have chapped lips. The next thing I have is a sample of the Benefit Their Real Mascara, and I like this. I like throwing the travel sizes in my purse because it's just easy and it's small. Um, this is my first time trying out this product and I actually like it. It's pretty nice. It makes your lashes look really long. The only thing I don't like is the end part. Um, it's supposed to be like one of those little ball things at the end where you can get like your inner corner and stuff. But I just noticed that this gets really clumpy there. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I'm still trying to work with it and see how much I like it. But I have that. The next thing I have is the L'Oreal Color Riche in Blushing Sequence. And I actually picked this up because Glam Life Guru recommended it. And I love this color. It's just really pretty. This is the color Whisper. And this is the color Riche. They're very similar, but it's a little bit brighter. So I like that. And it's also very hydrating as well. Wow, I have a lot of things on this purse that I like didn't even realize I had so it's kind of good that I'm doing this video to like go through everything. The next thing that I have is another Rimmel London eyeliner and this is just in black. It's their soft coal Kajal eyeliner pencil and yeah I like that. Easy. Rimmel actually makes really good eyeliner so I like those. Next thing I have is a little candy from the local sushi <laughs> restaurant that I got and this is in After Orange and it's just a Korean candy. Oops. And yeah, it just tastes really good, so there's that. The next thing I have is the Flower Cream Blusher in Pure Petunia. And that's what it looks like. This is the perfect cream blush ever. It's beautiful. Love it. I like to use that. The, actually, I think this is, no, okay. I have two more things. So I have these little, like, eye drops. And these are the Refresh Eye Drops. My eyes get really, really dry, so I have, like, a lot of these just kind of like all over the place and then the last thing that I have in my purse I actually just bought this yesterday and this is the La Occitane um, lipstick and I did not even know La Occitane made lipsticks but this is in the color Piv Pivon Delicate O2 I don't know I really don't know it's like a really pretty nude color and it is so moisturizing let's see I'm just gonna throw this up there it's like a really really light sheer nude color um, I wore it earlier today and it's just really beautiful it just kind of leaves like a really nice shine and gloss to your lips so yeah I like that and that is everything that is in my purse and so yeah I hope that you guys enjoy this um, I'm actually really surprised as to how much I can fit in this little purse if I had a bigger one, I would have a lot more stuff, but yeah, I think it's good for every day. I have a lot of lip products, a lot of makeup, random stuff. Um, so yeah, if you guys did a what's in my bag video, leave it as a video response below, or just let me know in the comments below what you guys keep in your purses, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!